M0 FXB AOR DV10 all mode all band scanner including DMR D Star Fusion and P25. So to save a memory channel, first thing is go menu and go in go across to VFO and enter. So and then enter, we're going to do this on the A band. So now we can we can type frequencies or we can just turn the knob to change frequencies. So I'm going to save my D Star hotspot for now. So we're going to go 433.550, enter. So we've got the frequency in there. Now we want mode. So we're going to go mode. And then you can leave it on auto or you can actually select, if you keep going across, D start, enter. So now that's in there. Press and hold the enter. And you'll get to here. And this is where you can uh, decide where it's going to go. But it's automatically put it on 3823. So that's bank 38, channel 23. You can change that if you want. You can just press enter. And then let's do that again. Let's go back up. Enter. And you can just type, say, 0105 if you want. Uh, but we're not going to do that. Let's just go back. Leave it where it is. Happy where it's put it. Uh, you can still adjust the frequency, the mode. It's all there. But otherwise, if you want to name it, so here, look, we've got T. Press Enter, and you start to get the ability to put in the name. So we're going to call it D Star. So number two has got a D. Look, so press D two, and then it should automatically move to the right. Uh, and then we're looking for Star, which is six. There you are, and T, which is 7, A, which is 1, and then R, which is 6. Enter. And that's it, you've added it now. Remember it's in 3823. So now we just want to finalise it Go by going memory channel parameter set. Enter and that finalizes it. So that's we're still in VFO mode. So now we can go menu across to the right, that's memory channels, enter, and then we can choose the bank, enter, and we can actually put in three eight. It puts the middle line in for you, two, three, and it goes straight to it. And there we are, that's our D star. And it works the same for any other channel you want to save. And then do save these to your memory card as well just to make sure it's stored permanently on your SD card. Bye for now.